insane. That shit crazy. Man, whoever got the motherfucking freeway blocked out need to get y'all shit together, dog. God damn. Nick ain't get on the fucking freeway. And Law got the freeway blocked off all the way on poke, dog. The fuck they got going? What's good, y'all? First off, man, I just got to say, Everybody ain't your friend. Everybody ain't your partner. Everybody ain't no real nigga. If I say I got you, then I got you. If it's fucked up, then it's fucked up. Just hold it down and be solid. Boy, for real, everybody ain't your friend. Everybody ain't your partner. Man, rest in peace to Big Mo 3, man. This shit crazy, crazy, crazy. And I know I'm a little bit late on this, but I had to do this because... I'll just be thinking about the Yeah, tell them what's up. I just be thinking about the rap game, man, and um and I've been trying to tell people for years, man. That thing ain't nothing but a trap. That thing ain't nothing but a trap to get your soul in there, man. Think about it. Mo three ain't even been on for about what, two to three years. You know what I'm saying? And and what and the whole point of this thing is, like you'll get you'll get two to three years of bliss, or maybe one year of bliss here on earth. Um Putting a fucking chain on, a Johnny Dang chain on, maybe getting a little grill, um, get a couple few spins here and there, and then guess what happened? The devil come through and claim your ass, man, because I'm going to tell you, the whole rap game is a booby trap for black man's souls. It's, that's all it is. Um, you can look at any rapper and, and every rapper in history, they always get trapped up and they always get wrapped up and capped up. You know what I'm saying? And then there's no way around it. You got to think about it. We got real shit going on. Oh, go ahead, buddy. We got real shit going on. Real problems. Oh, he want to be in the camera. We got real problems going on in the country. Um, viruses, vaccines, real problems. But we still, as a people, black people, we want to kill each other. You know, we want to still shoot each other. You know, we haven't, we haven't still, at this stage of the game, at this quarter of the game, we still haven't figured out who our enemy is. And it's not each other. You know what I'm saying? Um... It's the devil himself who is our enemy who got us divided and conquered and killing each other, man, and, and just putting each other, taking each other out the game. And and, and then like I, um, like I put on there with that footage, man, of uh, what's your boy's name, man? Um, damn, I forgot a little bro's name. I'm going to put it on the comment. But uh, Buddy right there was making uh, making jokes about uh, the, the highway being blocked because Mo3 was laying down dead. These niggas know, bro, dead. Everything, everybody in these cities, man, these rappers, they be knowing what's going on. That's like a, a way that they could tell you, uh, a way that they tell you what's going on. Just like my boy uh, 600 Breezy had the, the video where he had the money on his head for Quando Rondo. You know what I'm saying? This is street codes, and I ain't trying to expose the street code, but I'm just letting y'all know we're at war with each other instead of with the motherfucking real opposition. The real opposition is the fucking... The boot that's on your neck. The real opposition is the boot that's coming to kick your door down and give you a vaccine. That's the real opposition. The real opposition the motherfucker who's telling you to sit in your house. And another thing too, we got all these um these lockdowns that are supposed to be coming, allegedly coming or happening starting Monday and like they're doing in Chicago. They got a lockdown coming in Chicago. That whole lockdown is not about COVID-19. That lockdown is to lock those black Chicago people down from retaliating from King Von's murder. Because since King Von's been murdered, there's been over 60 shootings in Chicago. Over 60 shootings. It's been like, I think like 10 murders and over 60 shootings and unreported shootings that didn't get reported. It's been a basically a small scale civil war in Chicago because they what they did to my boy King Von. You know, um, that, that type of gang war it's been going on in Chicago and big cities like that since the early 90s and 80s. It's always been like this. Um, and that's because the government has divided us up. They put guns. They split us up. They know what they're doing. This is a big tactic. Big tactic. In the early 90s, the government was putting guns in Chicago when I was living there. They were putting guns in the community and just giving them out to the community when I was living in Chicago. And that was in the early 90s. So imagine what's going on now. They just got us killing each other, man. We need to wake up out of this fucking hell we're living in, this slumber that we're in, and wake up and figure out who the real enemy is. Because it's not you and me. We are not the enemy. I am not your enemy. The enemy is those fucking demons who control these rappers. 
The enemy is the devils who control the game. The enemy is the people who set the system up to collapse on the young brothers as soon as they get a little taste of fame. Y'all better realize what's going on, man. You know, all you yellow beezies and all you motherfucking uh, lame ass niggas out here keeping this shit going because you a cornball, because you a lame ass nigga, yellow beezy and all y'all niggas lame ass niggas who not the one. So you got to goddamn take other niggas out the game because you was a loser. The jealousy in your heart, the hatred in your heart you have for your fellow man, that shit going to lead your lame ass straight to hell. And you're probably already living in hell because you don't understand what's going on and where you at. You know what I'm saying? So y'all wake up, man. Let's stop this black on black violence. Let's stop this human on human violence. And let's figure out who our real enemy is and bring that smoke to the enemy. Because the black man is not your enemy. Your fellow man is not your enemy. The system is your enemy. You know, that's where it fucking your, the prison system is your enemy. The jailhouse is your enemy. The police, the, the racist police are your enemy. The racist system is your enemy. Segregation is your enemy. You get what I'm saying? To be divided is your enemy. To think you're by yourself is your enemy. You know what I'm saying? It's your big homie, big baby, man. We need to get together, man, and stop with this bullshit. But at this stage of the game, it's too late, man. Y'all fucking niggas are stuck in y'all's ways. And the devil got he's riding y'all's back like a horse. And y'all ain't gonna do nothing but let him ride you till you buckle. You know what I'm saying? So y'all wake up, man. Smell the coffee, man. Another one bites the dust, man. This shit ain't cool, man. It's gonna keep going till y'all stop it, man. It's your big home, big baby. Like, comment, share, and subscribe down below. Love all y'all, man.